Hi family! Um, I wanted to come on here really quick. Uh, I have my uh, sister and her family coming down um, today. Um, which is really awesome. And my niece and nephew. Um, so I'm super excited. Um, but there's a, a few things I wanted to tell you guys before the company gets down. Um, last night, something crazy was happening in the spiritual. Um, I remember um, speaking in tongues or, um, and, or speaking in my prayer language, communicating uh, with the Lord, Holy Spirit, all night last night, and um, I was watching a few videos this morning about how important uh, this weekend is, so another really high watch, uh, watch time because of Yom Kippur and um, uh, fulfilling the 8th uh, festival or celebration. Um, guys, I've never experienced uh, what I experienced last night. I remember... I just, I remember it was like my mouth was open and it was just, um, I want to say like, it wasn't even words all the time. It was, it was intense and I knew he's not letting me remember past knowing that I've never, um, I've never spoken that much, or I've never been in that spirit that much, that that's happened. Um, and that's all I can remember. All I can remember is, and I was like, and it was just flowing out. It wasn't just like a little bit, like it was a constant flow of, of sound um, and words. And... Um, while I was also watching these videos, I was kind of piecing everything together of what's happening in the spiritual and how close we are. And the fact that my sister is down, guys, her family is down for a wedding, which is happening on Saturday. And it's not the first time that the Lord has um, brought me to, uh, to that to being how significant it is that she's she's down um, for a wedding um, this weekend that's happening on on Saturday. Um, so there's there are things that's happening. Um, I know you guys can feel it in your spirits, and I just wanted to kind of give a confirmation that last night uh, was intense, and. Um, we're expecting some big events to to happen. We're expecting um, the rapture, obviously. Uh, I don't know what might happen before that or during that, but all I know is I experienced something intense um, in the spiritual last night um, where I was just... Like, I remember, like, it, it felt like it couldn't even come out, like, quick enough. Like, it was just, and I knew it was in the spirit because, um, there's a difference for me. When I'm, if I'm speaking in my prayer language, when I'm speaking with the Holy Spirit, uh, when I feel him come on me really, really strong and it just starts coming out, um, I know it's different, uh, between me and the spirit speaking through me uh, with that language because um, it's almost like I still have my thoughts and, and I can think and and um, I can move my attention on other things. But when when the speaking comes out, when the speaking in tongues or, or speaking my prayer language comes out, it's just something different. Like there's two streams of, of something that's going on. Um, and I don't know if that helps you guys at all because I know sometimes people, we tend to write off... Um, the spiritual, and we think it's us. We think it's a, a voice in our head, or uh, we think we're the ones that are just um, making it up, or what have you. So um, that's one way I know um, 
that it's, it's something very spiritual happening because it'll overtake me. And 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 again, when I when I'm speaking in my prayer language or um, uh, and speaking speaking in tongues, um, it's completely different. It's it's its own uh, process that's happening and has nothing uh, to do with what I'm thinking and what I want to come out. It just comes out. Um, so that's that's a way to kind of, um, at least for me, to know the difference between um, if I'm making stuff up in my head or if it's the spirit talking. So anyways, I just wanted to do a quick video uh, before they got here because um, I was watching uh, Kim Mosley's uh, video uh, talking about this weekend. I watched uh, Mark uh, Ikenawa, I hope I'm saying that right, um, the final moments um, video really well done um and um just in the last week or so the watchman's uh, watchman um he's got really good information as well so um i'm pumped i know um, i'm gonna have a great few days because i get to spend it with my sister and my brother-in-law and my niece and nephew and i know the holy spirit's gonna be all over that um and this weekend this weekend, maybe there's a spiritual wedding happening. Maybe, maybe something's gonna happen. So, um, I watch every day. Every day is a high watch time. Every day is Jesus can come back. The rapture could happen. Uh, we can be transformed. You know, the whole shebang. So, every day watch. Every day be excited. Every day spread God's love. Um, so yeah, I just, I hope this guys encourages you guys, um, and I just want to let you know that I've just never experienced what happened last night in the spiritual, so I know something's about to take place, because, um, just, it was just intense, like, I don't even, I don't even know if it was a conversation, or if I was crying out to the Lord, or if I was interceding, but, like, whatever that was happening was intense, and... Um, I'll, it was happening a large portion of the night. I remember that. And I, there was also lots of dreaming, and I think I was battling, um, enemies, um, and evil again as well. So, last night, um, whatever was happening in the spiritual, uh, was intense. So, things are ramping up, and, um, you know, it's just something will happen it has to happen so stay encouraged stay alert let's keep our eyes on our sweet jesus um and i'll see you guys super soon i love you guys bye